you know, three main points that we can always make on better drift boat fishing, and, and they're, they're pretty simple, and keeping them in mind will, will make life a lot easier for your guide, and especially a lot easier for you. So the number one rule, the number one point we make when we're fishing with a drift boat is we remind people to start with their back cast down on the water. If you're standing on the drift boat, we all stand there and the rod is elevated, and that's already decreasing the capacity of that tool to do the job by 50%. If it's 50% through the casting stroke and you start the back cast here, you're already behind the eight ball as far as the back cast goes. So number one, start with that back cast right down at the water. Second thing we encourage people to do is keep in mind the 45 and 90 degree rule. If the boat's moving the same speed as the current, you cast downstream 45 degrees to the gunnel. If your guide starts to slow the boat down, you adjust your cast back to 90 degrees. Now you've adjusted your cast relative to the speed of the boat and relative to the speed of the current. So 45 when the boat's moving the same speed as the current, 90 degrees if your guide starts to put the brakes on. And the third most important thing that we can encourage people to do when you're fishing from a drift boat is to fish for the future. And literally what we mean by that is nothing behind you matters when you're in a drift boat. You're bouncing through the water and you're going ahead and you see a fish rise back here, it's gone. Behind the boat is dead to you. Don't worry about behind the boat. Stay in front of the boat, look for your next target, downstream 45 if the boat's moving at the same speed as the current and you'll be a much better angler from a drift boat.